When playing in Azuma 11, who wouldn't want to have unlimited move manuals? Just think of all the times you've gone through a competition route, got a really rare move, and then had exactly one opportunity to use it before it's gone forever and you can't get another one. Well, what if I were to tell you that in Inazuma 11 Go Galaxy specifically, you can actually duplicate move manuals and have an unlimited number of them. Gone would be the days of, oh no, I've only got one Spirit Big Moves, who am I going to give it to? Now you can have 99 of them if you just follow a couple of steps. Now, if you're playing on cartridge, this is only possible on version 1.0 of the game. So as long as you've got the game and haven't updated it from the Nintendo eShop, then you will be able to do this glitch. Because it is a glitch, as I'm sure you can imagine, but if you have updated the game, the developers did catch this and patch it out, so you need to make sure you're playing on an unupdated version of the game. I'm also told that if you're playing the game on an emulator, I've never done this myself, but I'm told that the glitch is still possible on there as well. Not sure if there's any extra hurdles to overcome, but I know people who've done it without having to cheat. You can obviously just cheat in an emulator anyway, but this is possible on all versions of the game. However, it's not something I actually knew about until very recently. I've been in touch with a good friend of mine called Airy, and I was in touch with her to make my own guide on how to do this, but basically she sent me a guide so comprehensive to teach me how to do it, it was kind of a video in itself at that point. So I thought rather than just saying the exact same things that she's saying and then presenting it as my own knowledge, I'm instead just going to give you the original video that she sent me. So. From this point on, Tale of the Toaster is out, and the information will be brought to you by Aerihun. So, take it away! Hey, it's me, Aerie Gaming. Um, first name Aerie, last name Gaming, and I am going to... Today I'm showing the Infinite Hisatsu Manual glitch in Go Galaxy. Uh, this glitch only works in the original uh, version 1.0 of the game, so if you've updated this game, um, from the previous menu, then this won't work. This does still work in the English patch of the game. I'm not sure about the other patches, so I guess if you're playing those ones and test for yourself, I can confirm it works here. So basically, this is an awesome glitch where you don't have to actually grind for his Tatsu manuals. Um, if I can open the menu. <laughs> um, so, for example, um, <clears throat> you see here how we have no manuals for um, Arashi Tatsumaki Hurricane or Typhoon Tornado Hurricane, um, but we do have manuals for Inazuma Break. Uh, how this glitch works is you can get the manual you want, the move you want to learn, just barely off screen. And if you, yeah, if you quickly scroll up to it, and it's not, I don't think it's frame perfect, but you do have to be like very fast with it. You can, uh, you know, you can teach teach someone about have, actually having a manual for it. Um, so if we give it to um, Sanakuro, and yeah, he's on he's on the Hisatsu, um, still zero manuals here and. There's still two manuals for Inazuma Break. Um, and if we check him, yeah, he's got um, he's got the the man the move. Um, this also works for the Ultimate Evolution ones. I think yeah, there's none that I only have zero off, so I need to like I guess for demonstration purposes, I need to burn this one on. Yeah, she'll split in the house. Um, you can obviously sort the moves if you need. Okay, there we go. We've got a head banner now. Um, so. Okay. This, this, might, this will take like a couple of tries, but. <laughs> I might go up a little bit more. I, I'm pretty sure it works with the the um with the uh, 
Ultimate Evolution manuals. I'm just not getting the time in right now. Uh, I'm gonna keep trying. Um, I'll give it two more tries. That's not what I wanted. Okay, I'm gonna give up with that. Maybe you, it doesn't work for the Ultimate manuals. I don't know. I could have sworn I was able to do it before. Um, it does definitely work with skills though. Um, um, I just to point out for other Hisatsus, as long as you've seen them be used, um, or if they're on one of your players, then they'll appear in this menu. Um, so, I guess I like, like uh, Bloodsucker Bite here. I've got Vanfany, so it's, it's here in this menu because he knows it. Um, but for the also of the ultimate manuals, you need to actually have obtained it once to use it, and even then, it doesn't seem to be working for me. <laughs> My time might be off. I'm using the MUAs to record this, which I don't normally use. Um, but yeah, it's a good way to get like the version exclusive moves, so like a uh, Royal Heart Shot, um. Your Sword of Atlas here. You can get those moves in the other versions of the games. Like actually just to demonstrate here. My timing's off, so my, may, maybe you can do. Okay, there we go. So maybe you can do the Ultimate Evolution range. So I think that's just harder to do because they're at the end. Typically. Um, we give this to you as a demonstration. Um, I'll give it a timer because it's very close to his. Um, his Mixy Max move. Um, Sword of the Kings, I think it's called. But yeah, this does. The back on topic. This does work with skills. The only difference with skills is that they only appear in this menu. Um, once you obtain a manual for it, even if a player has a skill, it doesn't appear here. Um, so, for example, I have... Um, I obviously have Matsutagi from the story. He has um, pumped up as a skill, but as you can see, it's not anywhere here on this list. Um, so you do have to obtain a manual for skills first before using it, but... But the glitch still works just the same here. Uh, if I can demonstrate with prestigious. There we go. Um, I have already told this to every player on my... Um, on my original team. I'll actually showcase that in a second, but... Um, we'll give it to Terry. Yeah, just to demonstrate this, um, works very well if you just want to like, get something like Prestigious on all your players. All I did was get the first manual from um, the team that drops it, I can't remember what the team was, I think it's... It's on Vagan's route, or Wargolf's is in a... Um, God, on, I forgot the planet name. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's a glitch. Uh, I guess the last thing I need to say in, it does not work for spirits or totems. Um, I'm trying to. F okay, yeah. I actually do have some. I can. So, I'm going to try to do Plasma Shadow Shot. But, yeah, because it has this additional menu before, you actually can put it on someone. That stops the same with souls. Um, if I was to guess, it's because the game doesn't properly update the amount. But actually, I can't even click on other spheres I don't have the manual for. Oh, wait. I can. Oh, okay, I guess it's because I've seen this one, but I actually do have this one on the... Okay. Um, yeah, like... Doesn't work with spirits, sadly, but it works perfectly fine with all. Maybe he starts to. 
Um, I'm gonna try again to get it working with the um, ultimate manual. Let's try by amount. Does it? Does that filter? Okay, I think I've filtered it towards the top or away from the bottom at least. So, oh wait, I'm trying to find it. Oh, it's there, damn it. Okay. <laughs> well, if I maybe if I do it by element. Yeah. Okay, fine, we'll try we'll try at the bottom again like this. I I swear it works with all two manuals, I just cannot get it to work. <laughs> I'm like I've, I've, I've swear I've done it before, but maybe not. Anyway, maybe just because it's at the bottom of the screen, so it's a bit harder to time for me. But anyway, that's the glitch. This went on a bit longer than I wanted it to. Um, so yeah, have fun not having to find for a bunch of the same skill, um, especially skills that you can only get one manual of. Like I believe uh, Chawaza. And Kishin no Chawas are only one-time skills. They were in Chrono Sun, I don't know about this game. Yeah, that's how you do this glitch. Okay, I've put the recording back on because I just now got it to work for the ultimate shot manual. As soon as I start recording, I wanted to try it again. And yes, it does work for ultimate shot manuals. Just to prove it, here I already have phase one maxed out like I did uh, earlier in the recording. So I guess now um, we can max out um, shoulder burst and yeah, still no manuals. Let's see if I can get it another time just to prove it on camera. Th there we go. Okay, I've got the timing down. Um, let's do Chrysanthemum uh, Makana. There we go. Ultimate Evolve. There. Yeah, proof that it works with the Ultimate Evolution manuals. <laughs> okay, that's that's all again. Cool. Once again, thank you to Airy for providing the footage, the voiceover, the knowledge, literally everything to do with this video. Again, I could have just recreated it, but why do that when it's just, it's there, don't want to take the credit away. So thank you to Airy for this and hope that everyone who sees this video can make some good fun use of the glitch. I'm not sure I will be doing so in my version of the playthrough to try and keep it authentic, but it's out there, so have fun.